In this video, I will go over some of the best money methods from the most recent event week in GTA Online. Honestly, if you guys have seen the event week and all of the different bonuses, you will already know that the event week has not many good bonuses. So with the bonuses alone, do not expect to make millions of dollars. But just remember these bonuses can be used with other money methods, such as businesses and other things like that to make you guys more money. And without wasting any more time, guys, let's dive into the first money method. This first money method will be the buried stashes and the shipwrecks. In the most recent event week, they will have a massive three times money and RP bonus. Of course, the buried stashes are on the Kao Preco Island on the scope out mission. Also, just remember that the Kao Preco heist has a huge setup fee of $100,000, and you will need to pay this setup fee before you can dive in to the scope out mission. Now, for the shipwrecks, I would recommend going to a different website so that you guys can find all of the locations very easily. I believe that the shipwrecks will change locations every single day. Now, I like to use this website called GTA Lens, and I can actually just see all of the different locations. You will see for this day, it is over here. Honestly, guys, this website will just save you so much time. And I also believe it will update every single day along with the shipwrecks. Now, the typical payout for finding one shipwreck is $25,000 and 2,000 RP. So already just knowing that, having the triple money and RP bonus on this will be super useful and honestly isn't a bad thing to do. But moving over to the next money method, guys, we do have some new community series and they will also have some triple money and RP. Now, every time that Rockstar has these new community series and adds them. I would always recommend trying to find some good ones, especially in the stunt races. I feel like there is always something really good. For example, in the gameplay you will see in the community series jobs that I found one called Hang Time. This will have the triple money and RP. And honestly, this is really fun. It's just a lot of jumps and things like that. Now, of course, because I am doing this solo, I will not get much money whatsoever from doing this. I completed this race in just over three and a half minutes and only got $10,000. But if you guys wait a little bit longer even if you did this solo you would still make a little bit more money probably just over twenty thousand dollars but as always i would always suggest that you play these things with other players and friends you will have more fun and of course make more money for another money method we have the free mode challenges and events this will be paying out some double money and rp now you can only do these in actual free mode sessions not invite only sessions i believe that you can trigger them in invite only sessions if you guys have more than three players or something honestly it has been such a long time since I have done any free mode challenges or even been in a full public lobby but they are still a great thing to do the only problem with them is that they are kind of random there will be a timer in public lobbies when these free mode challenges and events will occur if you manage to win one of these events you will make some pretty good money overall especially if there is more players competing in the free mode challenges or event on to the next money method guys we have an adversary mode this will be the sumo remix adversary mode and it will also have some double money and the RP. Unfortunately, you guys cannot do this completely solo as it is an adversary mode. However, it will still be really fun to play. And if you do manage to get a full lobby of players and potentially even win the adversary mode, you can make some really good money. If I remember correctly, the sumo remix is an adversary mode where you guys have to crash into other players and try and push them out of an area. It can be really fun to play. And I would definitely recommend that you guys play this with friends. That will be all of the bonuses from the event week. So you guys can already see that the event week does not really have many great ways to make money but for the next money method guys we do have the new salvage yard robberies which honestly might be the best way to make money this week altogether there is three new salvage yard robberies and if you complete all three of them and sell each vehicle to yusuf you can make just over one million dollars here are all three of the new salvage yard robberies each one of these will roughly take you guys between half an hour and maybe an hour to complete it really just depends which vehicles you use for example if you guys have the oppressor mark 2 you will be able to complete these much faster. With salvage yard robberies, just remember you will need to earn a salvage yard. I also believe that you can just have the salvage yard with no modifications, which can save you guys some money in the long run. And last but not least, guys, for the final money method, we have the time trials. The HSW time trial that you guys can play on the next gen consoles is located over here on the map, and the default or standard time trial is located over here. As always, time trials can make you guys some very nice money, and it just requires you guys to have 
have a fast enough vehicle to complete the part time. The HSW time trial can make you guys just over $250,000, whereas the standard time trial can make you just over $100,000. And overall, this isn't really too bad, but once you guys have completed them, you will need to wait a whole week to do them again. You can also do the other two time trials, which will be the RC Bandito time trial and the Junk Energy time trial. The difference with these time trials is that they do refresh every single day, and if you guys beat the part time in them, it will make you $50,000 each. So like I said at the start of the video, this event isn't really the best money maker. You can of course still make some pretty good money from doing these bonuses, but I would probably not expect to make millions of dollars. But anyways guys, if you went on to enjoy this video or found it useful, make sure to leave a like. I really appreciate your support. And if you guys are new here, subscribe and hit that bell icon to never miss a video. Finally guys, stay safe, thanks for watching, and I will catch you in the next one.